Hello everyone, we have the Star Citizen Hangar 3 Alpha version 4 patch release. Uh, not that too much difference in this release to be honest, a lot of minor things apparently that not many people see. Okay, we've still got my little Aurora, I haven't got my Cutlass yet. Poor little baby's looking lonely in its small little budget hangar. A couple differences, we can actually um, open both doors on both sides now. Both sides have stairs. Steps. Uh, another thing I noticed is if you line up here, you don't have to use the use button anymore, you can just run. They still haven't got a walk mode. Still a little bit um, finicky, I suppose is the word, to jump into the driver's seat. But um, they seem to be working on the um, animations a bit, which is good. Let's see if I can um, make it a bit here. If we use Q, that changes there. Goes there, and then S and W, D and A. So there are the controls I've sort of um, seen. That. There's a slight glitch when you get out. Left hand is doing something. It's not lining up properly with the display pad getting 30 frames while I record. The bed animation is, oh hang on, it's new I've noticed. Yep. Apparently not. To hop in, we can aim up. Let's get out again. Charlie. Hey, just recording at the moment, man. And as you can see, we'll get out. Doesn't do any tearing or glitches. Um, otherwise, my little ship is looking quite tiny, to be honest. Still dark and dingy, but nevertheless, can't wait to be risking. Still doesn't support uh, full damage. Console hasn't really changed because you've got to pay to use it really. Hit tab and scroll. And that's um, when that's activated, the whole room goes dark. Darker. But, um, not much really usability on the hangar at this stage, but it is pre pre alpha. Everyone's going to be happy as uh, Larry in December when we can actually leave this and um, go for a flight.
thanks for watching and I'll post some more Star Citizen videos as we patch.